Hello everyone, my name is Total Mass Destruction and welcome back to another Paths video. So I went ahead and started watching this because I uh, decided, well, it's normally just music in the background, so I'll turn off audio, record this video, and then add my own music to the end so that way, you know, my, I can change my voice along with the audio and all that. Clicked on the video, started this whole video, and uh, he's voice acting in it. He's reading everything for us. So without further ado, this one's called Fight for the Magical Brain. Let's hop right this on into it. fictional interactive video story. Ooh. You'll make choices along the way to get different endings. You're damn right. I played this before for the Magic March, Brain. 1977. Okay. There's a magical device <clears throat> with the power to control people's minds. Dope. You forged it yourself for the purpose I of made stopping it? villains from having their way. Well, it sounds pretty While villainish. Your laboratory, you accidentally threw out this device. Okay. Thinking that it was one of the prototypes. Okay. Not the finished device. Oh, I threw the actual the thing out. The you throw out gets dispersed at the nearest garbage dump. So that's where it is now. Okay. That's what you get for not being careful. You go to the garbage right. dump to find it. Mm -hmm. It's appropriately shaped like a brain given that it has the ability to control another's actions like their brain would. Okay, sure. When you arrive, so I'm looking for a brain. your arch enemy is already in the piles of garbage looking around. Oh, damn. He must have been spying on you somehow and realized you threw out the magical brain. Shame. You didn't come prepared with any other magical devices mm -hmm. because you thought you would be alone. However, that doesn't mean your arch enemy doesn't have any. Oh, I see. You need I to see. get this brain before he does. Right. He already knows you're here. Okay. So are you going to confront him? Or will you prioritize looking for the magical brain? Damn. Okay. Okay. So we got our first choice. Uh, the guy ran it down pretty well. We got. Oh damn. We got. We got. We're looking for a brain. We threw it away because we're dumb. We're incompetent. You know that happens. Things happens. But right now we got to either a confront the guy also looking for it. Look for the magical brain. Now confronting him, I feel like I'm gonna go. Hey. What are you doing? And then he's going to pull a laser gun and shoot me, and then I die. Or I go and just look for it, and then he'll probably find it before me. So we'll confront him and see maybe if we team up or something. Something something crazy would happen. I don't know. Let's find out. Confront him. Yes. I'll be like, what are you doing here? Whoa, we play dumb, you know? You don't go looking for the brain. Instead, you decide to confront your arch enemy. Okay. You're standing about 15 feet apart and staring at each other. Mm -hmm. Both trying to think about what the other person might do. Your arch enemy puts Apparently his hand mad side, as if he had a concealed magical weapon. Out oh, his wand! You don't have any weapons, but that doesn't mean you can't fake him out by acting like you do. Oh shit! Do you want to put your hand by your side as if you also have a magical weapon? Uh huh. Or will you put your hands up as to not seem threatening? Hands up, baby! Look, I already explained my plan. Walk up to him, act dumb, be like, what are you doing here? I know we hate each other. What are you doing here? I go like this. He's going to go, hey, he's going to kill me, and I'm going to get killed. If I walk, I put my hands up, he'll be like, what the hell are you even doing? We're supposed to be killing each other, all that. And I'll buy some time, you know. It's all about uh, figuring out why he's here. See, see if he knows. If he knows, well, then we're just screwed. And there's not much I can do already. So, unfortunate. Yes, I will agree. But who knows? Maybe uh, maybe we'll work together and become... You put your hands up. Dr. Robotnik. Threatening. Your okay. arch enemy rushes over to you while your hands are up. Hell yeah. And inspects you to see if you have any magical weapons. I don't. It seems you truly don't have any weapons, he says. Nah, I'm just here vibing. He left his side completely vulnerable. Whoa! So you grab the weapon he had and take a step back. Yo, get fucked! You're a few feet apart now, and you're pointing his own weapon at him. That's a shame. You don't know what it does, but your arch enemy seems to be scared that you'll pull the trigger. Pull the trigger. It could be something that would hurt you at this close of a range. I don't care. Or even a trap. Do you want to shoot him with the magical weapon? Yes. Or give it a test shot by shooting it at a pilot? What if it's a one shot? Like you fire it and it has time to charge or something? We got to shoot him right now. All right. No test shot needed. Just blast his ass. Where are we going? 836? Wow. We skipped over. <laughs> we skipped over some stuff. Uh, boom. Blast his ass. Why would I shoot trash? If I shot the trash, I'd probably shoot the brain, and now we're both out, and now he hates me even more. I shoot him. You shoot him with the magical weapon, but things don't go well. Oh. He was wearing a magical reflector under No! His head, so the magic bounces back to you. How could I prevent? How could I? Oh, I couldn't foresee. That's all the weapon's magic does. While you're turned around, your arch enemy punches you forcefully in your back. Ow, dude, what you the hell? so much pain that you can only move slowly. Your arch enemy eventually finds the functioning magical brain and brings it over to you to brag about his victory. Okay. With the last of your energy, 
You tackle him to the ground. Ooh. Put your hand on the brain and use it to put a spell on him. Nice. The magic makes direct contact with his brain, so the magic reflector in his shirt can't reflect it. Good. The spell you put on him makes him desire to stay in the garbage dump for the rest of his life. Hell yeah. You slowly leave the garbage dump with the magical brain. Slowly. And oh, right. And you get someone to drop you back home for free. Oh, hell yeah. If you enjoyed this video, All right. please, please give it a thumbs up and share it with people you think would like it. You know what? I will give this a like. This was a pretty, this is a pretty good one. I liked it. There's five endings, as you guys can see. Um, because he had to rework everything and make it into uh, one video rather than clicking to go to separate videos, uh, YouTube was screwing him over for that, so he put it into one video. And uh, so because he has to rework it all in and stuff, uh, he's making them shorter. But that's okay because they're still entertaining and they're still fun. So thank you guys for watching. I got a good ending. I mo maybe even the best. I don't know. I'd like to see what you guys comment. I do know that in his comments, it's just a bunch of people, <laughs> yeah, saying stuff. Uh, but yeah, if you want, go check them out. It's literally Paths, P-A-T-H-S. That's all you have to search up. That's what, literally what I did up at the top in my search bar. So it's pretty enjoyable. Uh, and he has a handful of them up by now. So all you got to do is go over to his channel. I even put a link down below. Check them out. I have a playlist. I did all of his videos. If you want to check out and see which ones are what, what they're about. Maybe there's one you want to do. Maybe there's one you don't. You don't know. Either way, thank you guys for watching this video so much. I'll see you in the next video.